Aha! This is the box island! As a newcomer, do you feel a little confused? Here, Code Mao will be your companion, and together you can explore this special island of the Code World. Here you can construct buildings, build 3D decorations, create dazzling effects. What's more, you can create cool games in Box Island. This is the operation guide for Box.game. Try it now! Now control code Mao to explore this island. The WSAD keys can control the up, down, left, right movements of code Mao. Press key tab and you can see code Mao's position in the coordinate system. These values will change as code Mao moves. If you encounter an obstacle, press the space key to jump. Double press the space key to do a double jump. Press equal key and move the mouse to adjust the camera angle. Press V to switch your perspective. Press ESC to return to box.game editor. When we go back to box.game editor, we can see that it has four parts. Here is the block box. Each box contains a series of coding blocks, which are different in color. Each block stands for an instruction in box.game. This is the editing area, the core area for trainees to create in box.game. All the blocks in box.game are stored here. This is the toolbar, when you can create new project, save project as BCM file, and so on. We can change box island by changing blocks. Change items in the block and click start button to see if there is any difference. Ha <laughs> ha ha! Huge change, isn't it? Try to build something here. Right click to make a cube. Left click to break a cube. Return to the editing area and you can see these blocks. It means we can left click to break a cube and right click to put one. What we just did is based on them. Rename the project. And choose download to save the project to local.